and I'm carried away, transported. I've lost all care, all shame. I want to convince myself that these visions, undulating, unfurling, engulfing the horizon, will not continue. But then, it's not so much the vision that counts, but the swarm. The swarm that comes in like a thief in the night and snatches me up and then expands and expands and pushes me, precipitates me into a state of ecstasy, imprisons me there and intoxicates me, folds me over, corrupts me, dissolves me in a spasm of delight without check, without weight, without restraint, without will, won't or can't. Time, I try and fix my gaze on the familiar objects in my room, the things that I know are actually tangible, that smell, rust and decay, but the whole world seems to be caught up in this flood of extraordinary delight. A great stream of bodies flows by, one against the other, pressing, embracing, interlacing, and once more, I am caught up in an incessant, grinding action. It's maddening repetition inflicted at a superhuman speed which wipes away all possibilities of my resistance. And this, this rapid movement causes the, the very interior of my being to give way and collapse into a pleasing nothingness, only, only to dilate itself an instant later and fall apart again and then swell up and again come tumbling down and again rise up again an impure assumption an impossible impossible rhythm anywhere else dissolution dissolution at top speed i am homo cadatus i can experience past lives live dreams and soul travel I am the Minotaur, made manifest in a multitude, reverberator, debaser. I am the centre of percussion, the sweet spot of the swarm, the soul satisfier, accumulator, evaporator. I am the seed of the torrent, we are the sowers of the system, here in the long tail. of one with the other beast of the earth, including man. Two. He was the ancient Egyptian deity of Bubasis, a sacred spirit that inhabited the earth and the heavens up above. Three. He descended to a domestic pet, became a mere creature of habit. Four. But in the machine age, he became a cartoon character, enchanted by technology. Five. His fame saw him carved into an icon, a wooden doll, which in turn led him to become something far more wonderful. Six. For as soon as he stepped forth as a commodity, he was changed into something transcendent. Seven. Melted into air, he became an electronic image. An electronic image. His likeness reproduced everywhere. The one becomes many, and he is a department unto himself, the department of Felix, which contains multitudes. He is returned to his earlier incarnations, and is both of this world and another. He is a radiant messenger, a divine emanation of the tale. He is an angel hesitating near. 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 As above, so below. As above, so below. He is an angel hesitating near. 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 He 
he's an angel. <laughs>